Hey guys, welcome to another YouTube video here by Dragon Bile. Joined by Fire on the Anki down there. And what we are going to do is we're going to do the improved method of um, collecting metal, salt, sulfur, uh, any of those kind of things that you do with a normal pickaxe. And we're going to do it with the Yankee. And the reason we're doing this is to increase the amount of metal or whatever you're going to go pick up. And we are going to have it on the Anki overweight, but the Quetz will still be able to fly. So let's get out of here and we'll go do this. Right, one of the first things you'll notice is if we do fly and we knock off Eve over there or fire on Eve is because there's a rider on on this particular Anki we'll be able to pick them up again and it'll happen somewhere along the line where I'll knock them off by mistake and then we will see um, how we pick them up again so the basics fly out keep it nice and high look for any threats out there and I have been kicked out three times tonight already or DC'd and by the way this is the third bloomin time I'm making this exact same video uh, it crashed and um, it basically made my whole computer not register the previous movie so we're going to look around for a decent spawn there we go let's go down here and we get uh, even fire to work so sorry to Obi Obi actually helped me last night um, collecting by hand showing us how to collect by hand versus an Anki and um, that's the one that failed and it's a pity now but uh, sorry Obi we have to redo it and I see you not online but we will get you onto another movie all right so up we go we pick that metal up and away we go now we'll carry on like this you can carry on pick every little bit of metal up that you want to you can fly you can walk as I was saying this is just for illustration purposes I'm not really needing any metal at this point of time and there we go all right so we don't have to fly to the next one this one we'll just walk to now as I was saying if we bump fire off there while there's a ride on the Anki it's really easy just to go and pick them up again if there wasn't a rider on the Anki you would have to physically get off your quets and then go and get onto the Anki and get back onto your position so you can solo farm like this it's no issue but remember what we were saying is why you do it this way is doesn't matter if the Ankala over here becomes overweight he stays on one place the weight is kind of transferred through to your quets over here this quets can carry three and a half thousand the Yankee can carry just over a thousand so all right so you get the drift of the um the metal collection with it and then what I'll do is I'll just fast forward a bit and we'll go on to pick some salt, some um, crystal, all those other kind of things. Okay, getting the the nod of the head there of um, fire saying she's not hitting anything. So then you just move a little bit forward. I'll see you guys in a little bit so I don't bore you with my, uh, with my flight over there. All right, so we are back and we are coming down to the salt remember the Anki or the Ankylo will harvest um, stone first and then metal here again will go for the stone first and then it'll harvest the salt so we'll watch um, fire smack away with that tail and uh, she's harvesting that little bit of, of smacking back there earlier on when we were busy with the metal she'd harvested two th uh, no sorry I'm lying what just over a thousand uh, metal raw metal there and just like that quickly quickly all right so fire how much um, salt have you collected in this short period of time how much is that 520. right 520 metal collected there so uh oh not metal 520 salt collected there i'm looking back at our base and it looks like there's a wild wyvern over there if it comes towards my giggers 
a giga pen it surely will die so i'm just gonna check it out and if it is a wild one i'll definitely bringing be bringing it um closer to my gigas let's get around onto it though gotta get it to follow me nothing nah it's flying away all right i'm not too worried uh the gigas down there will take care of it so i will be with you in a little bit we are flying over to another mountain where i'll be demonstrating the same method uh, with a crystal and uh, etc all right well on our way to go and get some crystal uh, we've got a a smelter over here and I'll just quickly explain or show how easy it is to transfer your metal into these forges like this I'll be coming up next to it with fire on my side there and obviously it would be overweight so I would land I'd come up nice and close fire would be able to to get off there there we go fires off and easy transfer without really having to carry any of that metal just taking it out of the anki feeding it into that um the smelter and bob's uncle all right five you don't have to really do it all you can hop back up onto the anki there i'd say and we can get going Alright, so here we go. Land over here. Anki can, Anki's in place. There we go. Like that. As I said, rock will always get hit first, and there it does it. So basically, what the Anki is doing here is it's whacking all the sulfur. And um, sulfur, raw salt, obviously makes salt. It's going to be in demand. Sulfur needed for fire arrows. So sulfur is not a bad thing to go collecting and it's very easy to collect a thousand sulfur like this or just off this one call it group or um, outcrop of sulfur okay we don't really need the sulfur so i'm going to be moving on the corner in the front there i'm not worried about the corner this um eve can defend itself pretty well all right so what do we come up on we came up on some obsidian so go for it there let's see if you can hit some of that obsidian underneath us okay took the rock and now still hitting a rock next to us i think anyways let's move a little bit over it how's it going there fire all right we whacked is it all gone mm -hmm. all right let's walk over it show the the people we're not lying there we go all that's gone obsidian's harvested as well you can walk up onto the uh <laughs> onto the uh crystal harvest the crystal there for us fire Ooh. this corner is giving me a couple of bites i'm not really too phased about it getting the crystal there fire there we go getting the crystal as well so yeah then we take off and we kind of fly away corner down the bottom there poor boy so there we go we've basically collected any kind of resource you would have done with a pickaxe and uh, done much easier much quicker much safer this way either one of us has to disconnect the other one is there to help the other one out like happened last night and uh, as we were saying much quicker much more efficient you you also collect a lot more of the product when you're harvesting like this it's an old trick it's not one of the new tricks don't get me wrong but for the newer guys that are playing hawk it's definitely something that you must invest in it doesn't have to be metal you can make this out of wood if you like i like metal it's a durable also have a look at the design guys from the top down basically i've got uh, five of the metal foundations there and i've got two ceilings attached at the back going sideways the reason why the ceilings are at the back is when you build those um the ramp the metal ramp down towards the ground if your if your um, 
your ceilings were more to the front of the Quetz's uh, platform, it wouldn't build all the way down to the ground. Here we've got three, oh, lengthwise down, we've got three slanted metal. You can see it from below there. And if you had started this a little bit more forward, you wouldn't have got the three in. You wouldn't then be able to load the Anki up on the, on the ramp, as well as if the Anki does fall off by some chance, it's not as easy to go and scoop it up again. Um, while we're on the scooping, maybe I should just show you how it works. I will bump fire off. <laughs> Got the look. I'll bump fire off here and then I'll turn around and I'll go pick her up again. So, easy to bump off. You just go across a rock like that. Fire's gone. There she's there. I'll do a sharp turn. I'll make sure that to land next to her there and I'll walk oh, see I've just bumped her straight off again on that rock just take a swipe or two there fire get rid of those rocks there I'll turn in on her this should work just fine nope still the rock carry on again there we go rocks gone <laughs> and she hit the moth Okay, that should be it. Look at that, guys. See, it wasn't lying. We didn't get it right the first time. Um, so if you don't get it right the first time, don't really worry. You can always come back. And if there's a rock that's really bothering, just keep nudging at it. And you'll be fine. So there we go. Sorry about um, delaying on this movie for, for so long. It's been a week since I last updated. But I was away. I was in Mozambique. With some friends of mine went doing some uh, jet ski deep sea fishing <laughs> really really interesting um, yeah for such a small little boat in the deep sea like that and those massive sharks around it does kind of bring you to earth we didn't catch anything but um, some acquaintances of ours did catch and we had some raw tuna sushi kind of style it wasn't that bad I actually enjoyed it <laughs> fires looking at me but yeah as i was saying hope you guys enjoyed this this video and once again if you did like it please hit the like button and if you haven't subscribed if you are new to this channel please subscribe and if you need to or want to make some comments please write the comments down below in the comment box so that i can see what you suggest maybe other games if you'd like me to play maybe some tips on other things you'd like me to show just drop them down there i'll get back to you and uh, i aim to please thank you very much